Hi, everyone. I'm going to walk through how to use Elicit to make a forecast for the EA Student Summit Forecasting Tournament. So we're looking at the question, how many messages will be exchanged in SwapGuard? So on the Elicit page, you have a probability distribution and a place to enter in your beliefs. The way that you enter in beliefs in Elicit is to enter in an interval with a minimum and a maximum, and then put the probability that you think is in that interval. So here, say you think that between 5,000 and 35,000, there is a 90% chance that the actual value ends up being in that range. So you can see that Elicit allocates basically 90% to the range you specified, and it allocates the remaining 10% outside of the range. You can also enter in bins that are overlapping or inconsistent, and Elicit basically tries to match your bins as closely as possible, while also making sure the overall graph is consistent. So you could enter in, uh, if you think that it's more likely to be on the higher end of this range, you can see here that it's selected the range that you've entered and you currently have 30%, but you could increase this to say 50%. You can also add probability outside of the maximum value on the x-axis here. So you can see you currently have 0% allocated to uh, above 60,000, but you might wanna increase this and say 2%. And then you can click smoothing to make it look continuous. You might want to add notes as well if you're going to come back and look at your forecast uh, to explain your own reasoning and if you want to share it with others. So maybe you say here, um, cool. And then you can go to interpret and see the summary statistics for your forecast. So you can see here that the median is 26,400. And also the most likely value is pretty similar. If this seems too high to you, you can always go back and adjust. Alyssa will recompute. And then you can see that this is changed now. So once you're done with your forecast, you can submit it by clicking Save Snapshot. And you'll see this login modal. It's really important that you click Login and make an account because we can only count you towards the prize if you're logged in. So you can see once you've logged in that your submission is going to show up here. And this is basically a static URL that shows your forecast that you can send to other people or refer back to. If you want to come and update at any time, you can just take a new snapshot. Uh, it'll submit a new forecast and we'll basically just take the latest snapshot that you've submitted as your final forecast. So if you want to compare your forecast to the average, you can go up here uh, and click Elicit Aggregation. And this is an average of all the predictions that have been made on this question so far. If you go down to Interpret, you can see it'll tell you how your forecast differs from the aggregation. And if you want to see summary stats for the aggregation, you can go here and look at the median mode ETC. If you get stuck at any point and need more help, you can go down to our FAQ and look at how Alyssa works and how to use it. And you can always contact us uh, to ask any questions. Good luck for the forecasting.